Hi cuties! Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, my name is Lexis Danielle. I'm a college student, I'm 22, and I like to make a lot of lifestyle but also fashion. My style is very preppy and feminine as well. So if you guys are into that stuff, I also make curly hair videos. So if you're all into all of that jazz, then hit that subscribe button. Also, follow me at Prepster Alexis because I've been posting on there more the last as of like the last couple of weeks and I've been doing stories and I like to interact with you guys as well it's fun we get to know each other and whatnot but enough of me rambling on so today's video is going to be a how to style six pieces from my favorite place Target um, a lot of spring trends and as well I'm gonna try these on for you um, talk about you know the current trends that are going on that I have within that item and whatnot so yeah let's go ahead and jump in Hey cuties! Okay, so this is going to be the first dress. It's a baby doll dress. It is super adorable. Um, at first I really didn't like it when I first put it on and I was getting ready, but I was like, let's just give it a second. Um, yeah, so it just gives me a lot of like vintage vibes as well, like, um, like mom cooking at home type dinner thing. Like Little House on the Prairie, which I really like that. I'm really into like the vintage look as well, really feminine. So the first thing I want to talk about is the feminine details. And that is a big trend for 2020 as well as just having a sprinkle of feminine details. So with that being said, I want to talk about these like puff sleeves. For me, because I'm such a tiny human, <laughs> um, I don't... I tend to stay away from things that might make me look younger than I am. Um, so for me, I would stay away from the puff sleeves, but honestly, it just really has to... It really comes down to how you decide to dress things and how to wear them um, as well. So for example, when I talk about how you decide to dress certain things, it's for example the shoes. A lot of girls do like to wear tennies with these. But because my style is a bit more girly and feminine, I decided to pair it with a little cute heel and these have little bows as well, so I love that. Um, so that's one way you can dress it up as well. And as well, this dress can be really plain so you can really play with the accessories, but I do love this like open neck concept. But I didn't want to put on any jewelry, I just like the simplicity, so I just went ahead and put a little pearl little clip that you guys probably saw in my last haul so yeah okay so this is outfit number two this is a bit more casual outfit it's still super feminine so these jeans are wild fable they're super cute super comfy um, they still give you like that um, distressed look I love the light wash I feel like light wash is a great way to incorporate spring colors into your wardrobe and I just love the fact that they're cropped. Honestly, I didn't buy these cropped, I actually cut them myself. DIY! Um, so yeah, I love these. These fit high-waisted as well. So these are a go-to of mine. I got so many compliments on these jeans and they asked me where I got them and I'm like, I got them at Target for $20 and I cut them myself so I made them look into more expensive jeans okay so the next thing I want to touch base on is this puff sleeve trend here this is a lot more puffy than you previously saw in um, in the dresses and just to touch base look they have little pearls I I thought the, this shirt was adorable just because I like the pearls and I love pearls and whatnot. Like it's just so simple but so cute and it just looks really feminine and put together. And just to make it look a bit more girly as well, I just got my little scrunchie with the little whatever you want to call this and just did a cute little side pony. So yeah, just to give you guys a full look and this is the look. I love it. Okay, cuties. So this is the look. I love this. This is such a girl boss vibe outfit. I love this. This is like an Alexis look for sure. 
So what we're talking about from Target are these super cute trouser pants. They are ankle length and then they kind of cinch at the waist. Let me go ahead and zoom in for y'all if you guys can see that. So they kind of cinch in right about here. I love them. So they do cinch in, but they also give you like a paper bag look just with how they sit on your body. Bring a it with the super cute top from J. Crew. I love this. It's almost like a crew neck, but it's not. Um, it gives you that look of femininity, femininity with this super cute lace detail as well, super trendy. And we keep it in style with spring with the pastel pink. And honestly, I wanted to do a half up, half down just so you guys could get a better look of the lace. And then I paired it with some gold hoops and as well um, a cute watch. So yeah, I honestly just need some little loafers, but I can't find them, so yeah. So that's the look. Okay cuties, so this is dress number two. I adore this dress. Look how stinking cute. Oh, I just love it. It's like so cute. Oh my goodness, I love it. Um, okay, so... First thing I want to talk about is how cute they did the detailing of the neck. Um, almost heart shaped. It's really flattering. Obviously, I'm not heavy chested, so this is not really a concern. But it is very um, modest per se. Maybe if it was a bit lower, then I'd be concerned. But it fits really, really well. Um, so, yeah, I really like it. Also, a big trend as well for 2020 is white and having just that perfect summer dress to maybe go for a little beach dinner or um, maybe a little spring wedding maybe. I think this would be really, um, really cute. Now I did dress this dress down with my Jack Rogers. Um, with my Jack Rogers that are gold and white. Obviously, I could have still worn the shoes that I was wearing earlier in the other dress, but um, I decided to switch it up. Um, as well, I just wanted to show you the detail on this dress because it's not just plain white. It has little specks of like little flowers and stuff. It's so stinking cute. And the second thing that I wanted to touch on is that it does have lining. So you have another, like I just think that is so nice and it's really well made and it doesn't look weird or not well made or sometimes it can look just not right but this dress is a 10 out of 10. And I did keep my, uh, my little thing because I just thought it went super well. <laughs> 